Oh God! Somebody, please help! Ah, no! Thank you. I never shot anyone, I swear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get out of here before I change my mind. I will. Damn it, I swear it. That's it for Obscurus. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm heading there now. Hammond's coup failed. What's wrong with the shelter? It's in lockdown, but something's not right. Check it out, then call me. Damn it! Why can't zombie outbreaks ever be simple? and more. You won't have to get some of the board. We have value pricing. Now for a limited time, get the Memorial Mine and Reconstructive Surgery Special. Only $499. Only at our Wilmot Memorial Megaplex location. Now located in the heart of Miami Boardwalk. Synthetic Cosmetics. Beauty is skin deep and in the decision. Out of control. Gonna find some higher ground, get a better look. Well, I have zero interest in a free defibrillation, thanks. Those aren't zombies. Now, let's see. Brad, flashing orange lights, what do they mean? Override lockdown. Nothing gets in or out until the system is reset. There's a panel around back. Hit the reset switch and the exterior doors will open. And that's what I gotta do. Hold on. What about calls? Saving Hammond won't get you that Pulitzer. Uh, yeah, I know, Brad. It's just... I owe her one, alright? All right, 
Open sesame, shitheads. Systems reset, Frank. Get in there fast, or the zombies will get to Hammond before you do. Oh, shit, I hadn't thought about that. <sighs> Thanks for nothing! Helmet, I'm here to rescue you! Connor? Uh, no idea, but I'm taking care of it! Hey, uh, Brad! There are a lot of zombies in here! No kidding. There'll be three doors. You'll need to shut them from the inside. Death trap? <laughs> I'd cry with relief, but I need to focus on not pissing myself. God, I hope Hammond's all right. What do you mean? She's not here? Tom's people took her and Jordan. We tried to go back for her, but those hillbilly dicks hit the lockdown. Tom's probably holding her at the farm. I'll go check. Keep your radio on. I'll shout if I learn anything. Thanks, bud. Glad you're one of the good guys. I should check that out. We are of mind, young apostle. Only watch your ass. Those farms creep me right the hell out. Hang on! Yeah. 
my notebook.
Hammond, you hear? Coming from his closet? Okay. That's, um... Crap about Laurie again last night. Third night in a row. Us in the basement. A lot of scuff marks on the ground. Laurie comes in just as I get it fired. But she's all made a wicker. Aha! Secret entrance! Wait, what the shit? A secret entrance? For real? No hand. All right, maybe there's some clue as to where they took her. As the flames crawl up her body, I blow on her, and she comes apart like ash. Take the masked boys and meet me at the Kippix. Masked boys? God damn! That's one Machiavellian dairy farmer. What the? I've seen these before. This is what those whack job looters wear. Tom's keys. I bet these open every door on the compound. Kylie Hammond is sentenced to death for the crime of high treason. Holy shit. Something. That's it. So, this is what crazy looks like. Brad, Tom's gonna execute Hammond. He took her to that Kippick cement factory, North Peak. Are you anywhere near there? I wouldn't make it in time, Frank. I need to get ZDC evacs for civilians now that Obscurus is out of the way. Shit! It's up to me, then. What do you know? Frank West, the hero Willamette deserves. Yep, a shitty hero for America's shittiest town. Who knew? I'm a genius. Man, I can barely make myself a sandwich. No Hammond, but oh, spaghetti loops. and 
broke into the obscure space and made a lot of noise. So I took the chance during the chaos to get in there. It was all bone and exposed wires. And it smelled like the monster called her. It's unlike all of this. I almost regret not helping Fontana catch it. I am there's so corruption, grounded. and then there's... Frank won't need any help turning this into a media sensation. It's massacre theater. <laughs> Sounds like it's coming from the roof. We give of ourselves so that the group may live. And if someone won't do that, well... If I walk away now, Hammond's toast. One trusted ally ...who would destroy me out of ambition. If I walk away now, Hammond's toast. <laughs> Walk away now, him.
just building a community. We're building a new world order! Oh, shit. Get up there from one of the other buildings. on this one.
Jade Hammond. Tom, no! For conspiring against uh. your lord. Look at me! And commandeering his rightful possessions uh. and plotting his death! You think you're a leader? You're just a lunatic! You are hereby sentenced to a beheading in accordance with the laws. Not stop! Set down by me! Bitch! Hey! Over here! Traitor! Just a second, I, I was just trying to protect you. You're all my people. You needed my protection. You call that protection? You, you, you don't understand. Look, a father, he has to make choices for his children. Sometimes... Ah! 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 Nice. This bump. Seriously, come on. What, you know? Come on, everybody does it. It's like the end thing. Now we just have to kill a robot zombie marine, and Wilmette will be its old self again. Wait, what? So, there's this zombie in an exosuit, and I need to blow a hole in the sewers. Okay. We can help you with that at least. I'll have Jordan meet you down there. Thanks, Hammond. You're a real pal. You know... I thought you were dead back there. You sprout wings? Nah. Whoa, really? Okay, I like you. Hey, Brad. I'm heading back to the sewer. Hammond's people are going to clear the way for me. Hey, Zane. This is what happens when you're not a dick all the time. Too bad you can't see what's in them.
All right. What do we have? Frank. I'm surprised to say this, Frank, but it's been a goddamn honor. What is this? Goodbye? You aren't coming with me? You said there's a zombie in an exosuit down there. Hell no! Just use your camera to find the weak spot. You've done it before, you'll be fine. <sighs> All right, Brad. As it's zip. I'm going after Calder and getting that hard drive. All right, evac choppers are inbound. And I have a message for you. So, hey, Frank. Someone's been accessing these files, and I have a feeling it's probably you. So, if you find my body, do me a favor. Try not to piss on it or anything. What the hell? I can get her on the radio. What's the point? The point is, to feds like me, there's nothing more dangerous in this world than a journalist who'd stop at nothing to bust my ass. And if there's two of them working together, shit. I think we're past that. We'll see. Would you like to be dropped? <sighs> Bingo. <laughs> the 
colder than hear that, then at least I know he's ugly and dumb. Of all my bad ideas, this is definitely, definitely the worst. What the shit? What the Come on, Ruth. Need extraction. Brad! Brad! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! 
Sell this to the highest bidder. This time we're gonna do it the right way. Yeah, you keep telling yourself that. Step away from the hard drive. Now! <laughs> Sorry, Frank. Bye. So, what? No more mini golf? Hammond needed me. Her tyrant had turned into a psychopath. So we took him down, and Hammond made sure he wouldn't be getting up again. In exchange, Hammond gave me the most important gift of all, friendship. And more importantly, a big bomb to blast my way into Calder's lair. The sewers. Calder and his posse of creepy, smart zombies had turned them into some kind of den of spooky-ass shit. And Calder himself, can talk. Whatever he's become, there's still a little bit of psycho douchebag human still in there. Naturally, I grabbed the intel and booked it. And that would have been where our story ended. Frank West, triumphant hero of Willamette, once again. Vic Jew. Thief. Hellspawn. She stole my evidence. She held a gun to my head, and now it's on.